numbers. Now, one can argue over whether getting numbers is the mark of skill, as that is the bar which the developers set, or whether the arbitrary values assigned to actions by developers should be regarded as sacred. If one is to argue that, however, they can kindly do that in another video's comment section. I'm more interested in what happens when a game's action is directed to congeal to a theme without any score to distract the player. Bloodborne puts in the effort to make players fight for their lives, but so long as their health is good and vials plentiful, there's nothing telling the player that their approach is invalid or subpar. There are gradients to the quality of every build and they vary in their individual capacities to deal with problems, but within the parameters of surviving the encounter, Bloodborne isn't fussy about how you get the job done. If you fought for your life using carol runes to recover quicksilver bullets, good job. If you fought for your life by hurling Molotov cocktails at a boss out of nowhere, good job. If you fought for your life by having a flexible arsenal and you cycled through each weapon as it became the optimal one, good job. Every approach gets zero points, so all are equally valid. Success is all that 